can climb it. Right near the satellite dish. Do you wish to activate the Breckloo spider? Oh, nice. Wow, this actually looks better from this direction. Yo, check out these robots. I can't shoot them from here. I'm a sitting duck. Look at that. I'm real. Oh my god, dude. God, it's went fast. Oh my gosh, dude. Check out the... The robots up here. Let's scan one of them with R3 now that I don't have spamware. I spec Look at the paws. Look at the paws. On the specter. Now, I'm gonna walk you through how to get into this circle over here. Where you see an alien boss level 13 to fight. So to begin... You walk into this building, you're going to hop to the left, pull off that thing, and then you're going to climb across and go through that door. Tart I am. So I pulled that off with L2, um, triangle tapped, and then R2. So let's go over here to the left. Double tap X. I don't think it matters which side. It may matter though. Okay. Let's hold away. And then circle to jump. Actually, you just did it with the analog stick. Oh, no, you don't. You just hop over it. Okay. So I'm going to pull out the fuel cell. Ugh. That has, like, infinite batteries in it. Okay. So let's hop up here. I don't even know what that power cell is right there. But I'm going to push this box down. So L2, triangle, and R2. You have to loosen it, and then you can push it down. I managed to loosen it, so I'm going to push it off the edge. And before I hop down, I'm actually going to hop across and obviously grab the supply cache right here. And then you can push it away from you on the first floor. To over there. Um, so actually, this power cell right here, it opens up that door at the top left. And this power cell just gives you extra items. You do get a cutscene, and then you'll go into the other side. So this is my companion cube. Alright, so, let me ignite the fire gleam. Watch out, the wall's gonna blow. Okay. Telgo. Oh, here it is. So let me remove the energy cell from the first room. It's just like FF10. You, you got the... You, you gotta be like, uh, on the far land. The far plane. You have to go to the far plane. You have to be sitting there. And Waka, he's like, he's like, hey, bro, like, I don't, I don't know. But, but. And Travis Tate. Our message. Would you just send it, you just send it as soon as it's done compiling? Okay. So this one, so this, it opens up after that cutscene, you go to that door at the top left. We could also obviously take this power cell, place it over there, and then grab items. But first, let me just hop up here. Wow! Look at all the look at all the power in the cable. Do it. You don't ask to go. I was like, yeah, it's true. I wouldn't. Like, why would that? Why would I want to go? Like, honestly. Oh, I have to climb up more. amazed because I've been really getting everything set up all I do is win so on the second floor after you climb up to the second floor over here um, you have a ladder okay and then essentially you pull off that thing with L2 triangle and R2 and then you hop up here, and you get a glide. 
So I'm going to jump up and press square. I think it teaches you on the screen, okay? It teaches you how to use the shield wing. So you jump up and hold square. You have to take a, a trust fall. And then you can knock down this ladder. And that leads you right back to the beginning. So you can go straight ahead, uh, swim across, climb back up as another shortcut. Look at this awesome sphere, though, dude. It looks pretty insane. So, once you get here, you kick down this ladder, you're gonna climb up here, hop over here, and then it tells you to use your shield wing. So you're gonna jump and press square. Well, you press X to play it. What's the hap, Trav? You and me go back a ways. You're gonna run to the east. There should be a power cell somewhere. Oh, actually, I need to enter the code 7482. Trav here. It's like a huge interest in movies. Alright, so 7482, based on that thing. I feel like that was like a pretty, pretty good ending. Right, so let me pry open the door. Cool. Thank you, Hank. We're done. Security. Hank Shaw is ready. Oh, Hank Shaw is ready for collection. Who's Hank no, Shaw? He's still breathing. No, he's still breathing. I want to bring his bachelor, bachelor though. Hey. though. <laughs> Yo, check, check out this area. Hey, one. I added it to song. I have a playlist called Songs You'll Lose. And then I have, like, I iterate on this other playlist. Alright, so after I get out here, let me lower the ladder. And you have to continue this way. And then once you make it over here, you pull that thing off. You're going to glide over and fight Hank. Or good timing. I press do quickly. So come over here. I just scrolled back to, to that point of the the puzzle just to show you how easy it is to get back up so let's drop this thing right here and then i'm going to pull off that thing and then i'm going to go over here i didn't i didn't realize this was here they have the little uh the little bumper from mario so ev everyone's a dj everyone has their own websites um dj m3gan obviously they're making a new movie called, like, the producer of the M3GAN movie. He's actually making a movie called Night Swim, which I haven't seen. So I tap up on the left analog here, and then I'm going to tap X and then square to glide. There we go. Okay. So, so I made it to Death's Door. I made it. I was listening to some like buzzy music before I walked over here and it you're looking at the I was looking at my YouTube for this with like all the buzzy electro music playing and I was like whoa check out this area it was a triumph song the aperture like science for that console. It's damp in here too. what 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 was that song uh I don't actually know what it's called like the name of it Dr. Isn't that sad? Oh, still alive. All right. Do you wish to activate the recluse spider? Oh, nice. Wow, this actually looks better from this direction. Bell Walker. If <laughs> I thought, I wish they actually put comic comic uh, boxing gloves on it, but they're way too good. Wow, check that out. Everything in this game looks like a movie. Cinematic. Okay, I think those circular one loaded with Hades backups. It's like an isosceles triangle. I'm gonna knock down this. Uh, I'm gonna knock down this arm. An arrow. Let's hope you have damaged it. Yeah. Well. Now that it's down, I should be able to access that pod. And this is on the PS5 console. If compared to the PS4, Horizon Forbidden West looks way better on the PC. Here. 
Got the aliens, dude. I got 40 tank tops that all have alien symbols on them. I have a hat with... Wow. They're triangles. Any, Any idea, idea what the, what the hell a clone of Elizabeth's Elizabeth thing where it was like, oh, actually, I'm more of a friend, like a, a better friend Ooh. with Eric than you are. So what's really cool about this building is it looks like this one closed down soccer turf field that uh, my dad used to play soccer at. It was pretty cool. He destroyed the computer. Oh my gosh. Eric. I remember Eric, uh, I was trading Zoom stock. I was buying like $300,000 in Zoom. And, uh, I was at like 155. I was up like 8k or something. And I like spoke with him about like trading, like mid while I was doing that trade. That was like the Friday before the the, the week where um Apple whatever. That was so exciting. I was like sitting there and all the all the social media people there were tweeting. Like I had uh, the fly uh, posting on Twitter, uh, every single new status. My Excel would read if it was a new status or not. And I was in there reading everything on my Apple Watch. But the wrist detection turned off. So I was able to uh, keep up with everything going on. All right, stodge. Jeez, dude. All right, so that's the third shot. Let's do the fourth shot and then you get to shoot uh, from in front and then from the back. Those little coils, which I'll show you now. And you hold up on the D-pad to add medicine berries to your pouch. You could also use small health potions. Alright, so... Let's hit that coil. Let's hit that coil. There's one on the back, too. There we go, dude. So the first coil is on the front, the second coil is a little bit to the right, the lower. The third coil is on the back, the fourth coil is on the back, and the fifth coil is in between these two arms. Alright guys, here we go. Finish him off. Uh, there. There's a current. Is it heading for an exit? Oh my gosh, dude. I feel like I'm watching Spider-Man 2. The video game. They like, uh... Like, they're inside of a ship and they like, get the electricity power. Um, I think that's after they chase down, like, the crocodile. Oh my god, dude. I'm gonna die. What am I doing? I made it, I made it. Shit. Look at that. I'm real. Oh my god, dude. It looks like Metal Gear Ray. Oh my god. No way. That looks amazing. For Metal Gear Solid 2. Obviously, I'm sorry, I can't name. Maybe I could just go through this door. I guess there's no climbing in here. Let me escape. I have to get away from Eric. I did, bro. Oh my god, dude. I messed up. But, I mean, the first one was, like, insane. The second one was way easier. So, this has, like, really cool lighting. Check out the little drips. I'm gonna tap L2 triangle, R2. The water drops, they, they could look a little bit better, honestly. Um, overall, like, this looks like the Jello in RS3 or something. Or, like, the Mr. Robot pool in his New York City apartment. Which looked super cool. But let's go through this vent. That's the only episode I saw. Gotta swim fast. Oh my gosh, dude. Check out the, the robots up here. Let's scan one of them with R3 now that I don't have spamware. Look at the pause. Look at the pause on the Spectre. No, okay. 
Oh, acid could work against the machine. All right, let's go down. Oh my god, dude. How does he detect me? How does he speak my language? Okay. I made it. Oh my god, dude. Go underwater! What are you doing? Swim. Alloy. Okay, here we go. I made it. Phew. Alright, let's open up this door now. So, I, I managed to make it past the Spectres. Level 25. I'm only level, like, like 11 at most. Powerful. Eric was level 13, which is here. insane. Promising. Oh, wow. It's just... Um, like, Destiny 2 is clean. Yo, check out the water graphics here. That looks sick. Oh my gosh. That thing looks so cool. Oh, nice. I reached level 10. 10 out of 10. Dude. I had like 90 sushi pieces. It was so nice. Oh, so this is in my stash and not even in my inventory. Look how many medicinal berries I have. I have so many extras. And workbench. Yeah, there's an upgrade workbench too. Alright, so let's do some weapon upgrades. I'm gonna upgrade my Forge Fire and Trip Caster. Let's upgrade my Frost Blast Sling. Wow. Check out this robot here, dude. So we just... We just pried its... My like, camera off. Or something. And then Zo, Zo was like... Zo was like, you pried the camera off with the robot. Signal for my focus. Nice. So, let's go to the next unknown campfire to save and continue. So I have to go all the way over here to get to Plain Song. Tall neck. Look at the tall neck at the top right. Oh my god, dude. No way. All right, let's let's put away the quest. Look at the tall neck. Jesus. Dude. That tall neck looks sick. I can climb it. Right near the satellite dish. Knock me into my own blast trap. I can't let that happen. Go, Alloy. Oh, I ran out of berries again. Thankfully, I went to my stash, dude. So, this time I'm actually going to take a screenshot with my Elgato 4K capture utility. When it gets next to... There we go. So let's climb up. Like, that's just a nice picture. Alright, let's go look at the tree village. I saw it from the winery. Wow, dude. Look at this place. Oh, is this plain song right here? So nice, dude. The water looks stagnant, though. They have the Joe, De the Joe Girte hair. And they both look exactly the same. Nice. And I was like... Like, I, I, every time I got 